Well, here I am back at this radio again, and I think I've finally found some kind of consistent pattern in its behavior. Let me show you now. And, and it probably won't be consistent, of course. Turn it off. It goes off. Turn it on. <laughs> Not supposed to come on. It's supposed to stay off until I pull this out and put it back in very carefully. Oh man, I tell you, this radio, it just always does something different than what you want it to do, for crying out loud. It doesn't work when you want it, and when you don't want it to work, it decides to work. I notice it's going off a little better than it was before. Well, before it wasn't going off at all when I turned it off. And with it in the off position, I hear that funny zing, 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 zing sound, which I'm sure should not be there. With the switch off, well, if Q27 is not operating properly, then with the switch off, you would still have some voltage getting by. So with the switch off, we would still find a little bit of voltage. We can find a lot more than a little and find the whole. No, we don't. Yeah, see? I'm not sure what to make of that. I'm not sure of anything with this radio, frankly. I feel like I'm just shooting in the dark all the time with it. You can definitely hear that sound. Here, have a listen. It's very high pitched. And I'm sure that's not supposed to be there. But really. And how can this if you can answer that question, that'd be good. Right on. Now it's not going to work. Now I get my chance to demonstrate something. Pull this out. Now with the switch on, put it back in very carefully. Voila. I'm guessing I'm break. As, you know, as you put in one of these plugs, you open the circuit from the batteries. I'm taking a wild guess that the radio is locked up. You pull this in and out quickly, and it just switches from that supply to the battery supply and it stays locked up. And I finally do it slow enough, put this in slow enough that it breaks the supply from the batteries before the charger supply kicks in. Then the radio gets a chance to reset. Okay, that's my theory. <laughs> that's not just another fiction story made up by me. But you know, you always got to have some kind of a theory behind these things, or you're paralyzed on what to do. So, what's that telling me? That's telling me if I took the batteries out, this radio would work all the time. That's quite the notion, isn't it? Turn it off. 
turn it back on. So, so I did that fairly quickly. I turn it off. We'll leave it for a while. Last time I left it for a while while we listened to this funny sound which is coming out of there. I should pop the batteries out. Well, I don't want to do that right at the moment. That's going to disturb the radio a fair bit. So let's just continue our little experiment here. So I believe now, if I turn it on, it will not come on. Okay, the sound has disappeared. The funny little chirpy sound. Pull this out. Put it in very slowly. Yeah, hey, isn't that consistent? Okay, so let's pop these batteries out of here now. Get them out. Get them out. Now, my theory's correct. Should be able to turn this on and off all the way like. Interesting. Still makes that sound. Apparently, my theory is not correct. Well, okay, man. There's something. There's something here for sure. Uh, and I don't know what that might be, but we got some consistent behavior here. Okay, on, off quickly. Off. Back on. Works. Off. Back on. Off for a little longer here, a little longer time. Hey, what can we do for a minute here? That might be interesting. Do what we did before. Have a listen. Okay, I, re I really don't know if that's coming across. So it's, it's faint and it's high pitch. Now we turn it on, should not work. Pull this plug out, I'll pull it out real slow. And now I put the plug in slowly. Okay, there you are. <laughs> I, I, that's my first really interesting observation on this radio after hours and hours of troubleshooting it. Um, this we got to be able to figure something out from this. We got to be able to figure something out. Well, it's getting. Uh, I think it's getting a little more interesting now. I'd be real interested in comments from anybody who's been watching this, especially if you've watched the entire series. Uh, but if you haven't watched the entire series, it looks pretty much like what you've seen in this video. Me poking around. Except in this one, I've gotten a very consistent response. And I'm able to make the radio work on command. We're in a whole new world now with this. Maybe a whole new world to hurt. <laughs>